I am going to be filming the long-awaited what is on my iPhone. It's so special because and also really great timing because I actually got the iPhone 6s plus um, I'm going to explain why I got the iPhone 6s plus but I got the same color it is just gray and black I have the same case actually there's a story behind that too but um, yeah to the iPhone 6s plus is because one day I was at school and all of a sudden the screen of my iPhone 6 plus just just stopped working for some reason I have no idea why and then I went to the T-Mobile store and they're like, oh, we have this new jumpstart plan type thing. And I'm like, oh, what is that? And basically what I had to do was I had to get this cheap, this cheap phone, which you guys saw me complaining about when I was tweeting. And I got this phone and I hated it so incredibly much, but I had to get it to like basically start the jumpstart plan but with starting that I didn't really have to pay much for my new phone so I ended up updating and it was just like really really great and I really really liked how it worked out yeah so now I have the iPhone 6s plus it has a few different things about it, which I will show when I demonstrate it um but yeah I'm going to show you it says a little 6s the iPhone S basically they should perform trying to brag about what I have or why I have a new phone in like probably less than a few months but like again it didn't it barely cost anything like there's no down payment or anything so it's like a really great plan that T-Mobile hooked me up with but I'm going to just get into my hair looks disgusting in this video I'm going to get into what is on my iPhone 6 plus Open up really quick this is annoying okay so I just have this um, really nice kind of like palm tree background going on um, because it's just really, really pretty and I really, really like it. So I just found it off of Tumblr, which I can try to link down below where I got this lock screen, but I probably won't be able to find it. My hair looks so gross. Okay. Okay. Basically, if you slide to the right, you can see like all your contacts or whatever. Um, and then like in all the apps, it's really, really cool. This page, I just have messages, calendar, photos. Uh, camera, weather, clock, Google Maps, videos, uh, notes, reminders, iTunes Store, App Store, books, iBooks, Safari, and settings. And I just put them in a different order because this is how I kind of had it on my last phone. So I kind of liked how it was. So I kind of just moved it around. Then at the bottom, I have phone, Google, email, and music. And email, I just have Gmail and mail. Yes, I have a lot of emails. You don't need to tell me. I know. I'm don't check my emails <laughs> um then I also have music and this is something that definitely changed I got eight tracks and I got this thing called uh, VS VSM and I I'm starting to use my music so literally I use every single one of these apps I will try to like link my accounts to, to SoundCloud and eight tracks because I don't have an account for like VSM VSM is basically like that old app that I used to have where I could like download music and now it has this stupid advertisement basically you can just download whatever tracks you want so this is my recent playlist um you can just download them like type one in and you can just press download and it's really really convenient i love it so much then i have uh soundcloud um i've had soundcloud for years uh, or for many of my um different type of iphone videos um, I have that and I also have um, my music and this is one of my playlists and then my other one is just a bunch of reggae because I'm really obsessed with it right now so yeah um, I listen to I really use my music a lot more now because I love Apple music um, and then I just have eight tracks I was just using this to get ready for this video I t uh, basically listen to all these different songs it's amazing I used to absolutely hate eight tracks um, for some reason because it was just like stupid to me but literally it's so awesome so if you want to look up something say like uh you know like deep house so you find deep house and then it just keeps giving you links or like little tags and you can do like chill and then you ha can just go through all the different kind of like ones that they have and it's really really convenient and great on the next page i just have a lot of stuff actually and i have a lot of stuff not in folders but we're just gonna go through them i'm not gonna like open each app because that would be crazy i'm not gonna open up basically i have finance extras and folders that is absolutely irrelevant those are like all the irrelevant apps except i have my secret app there and i have find my iphone but that's about it um iMovie this actually is new because these came on my phone and i just decided to put them in a little folder i might start using my phone for vlogs maybe i don't know yet um yeah i have photos and this is basically how i keep all of my photos like you know like a 
in a place so like if I don't want to keep them on my phone I can keep them somewhere else while they're still on my phone if you get me so ever album you guys know about that I had Google Plus because um but like basically you could um like open your things then told me to download the Google Photos app and I got that and so I have all my photos on there so I have like a lot of photos if you guys can see next thing I have is work and then it's just basically like school work apps that help me in school um, I have Google Docs, um, Translate, uh, Desmos, Desmos, and Edmodo. Edmodo is for my AP World class. Basically, my teacher puts all of his like stuff on here, like all the assignments that we need, um, stuff like that. And then I have Google Docs because sometimes I have to type, type papers in school. And I have Desmos um, because it's kind of like used for like graphing. I have streaming, and I use this when I want to stream stuff onto my um TV, um, yeah, basically I have this chrome, chrome casket stick that you can like move around the house and put on any TV and right now it's in the living room and I use it so you have to have the little Chromecast app and I have Netflix because I like to watch Netflix on there and I also can stream YouTube which is awesome. I have um, games and these are some of the games I just randomly downloaded. Um, I like uh, Best Win, Magic Touch and um, stuff like that. I'm going to do a separate video on how I edit my Instagram pictures. I don't edit my Instagram pictures, but I really want to work on my feed, so I'm going to start editing my Instagram photos, but um, I'm going to just go into ViscoCam. I use ViscoCam actually whenever I post a picture because I put them in like folders, what am I talking about, in the little blocks so I can tell, um, like, uh, so I can tell what looks good on my Instagram. But right now I've been just using it to edit pictures. As you can see, I have a lot of pictures. But yeah, and then I have all these other apps, which I've already talked about millions of times. Then I have this app called Clint. Clint? I think it's called Clinch. I really don't know. I'm probably saying it wrong. Whatever. Basically, it's this voting app that just decided to crash. Um, it's a voting app where you can, like, go and, like, vote on people's stuff. And you can, like, post your own stuff. Like, say, um, this girl says natural makeup. Natural or makeup. And you just like press one or whatever and then you can like see the votes and you can post stuff yourself and um see how it works i'm not sponsored by them by the way i just saw it from sienna's video and i really liked it i thought it was cool um then i have okay it's recording <laughs> then i have um uber because i use uber um all the time i use it usually after parties or like after football games or before football games to get places because my parents can't always drive me and I have a few more months to get my license so I use that a lot okay so basically um wherever you are um it basically tells you what concerts are playing near you or in the in the further ta like future so this one's Shawn Mendes plays Saturday October 24th and you can press attend maybe and then get tickets and it's so convenient because you can see where it is how to get there how to get your ticket and you can like see all these different artists that are playing around you, which is great. Um, next page is all my social media that is basically the important page. I have Twitter, which you guys know I am obsessed with Twitter. My Twitter is C-H-L-X-E-E-E, -E -E, so three E's and one X, and it's always linked down below. Um, I'm on Twitter, Twitter religiously. Basically, I have an Instagram, Twitter, what the hell, Snapchat. Um, my Snapchat is Chloe Harris 13 You guys can follow me on here if you would like. I still hate my hair. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> yeah, so I have that. Um, I'm on it religiously. Then I have um, Instagram. I'm on Instagram all the time, but I don't really post. Um, the last time I posted was three weeks ago, but like you guys can follow me. Um, it is just Chloe.h2001. It's always linked down below. Um, I don't really go on Instagram that much. I don't really know why. I don't really like it as much anymore. Just because, like, I don't have much to post. And I kind of post, um, like, on Twitter and stuff. Um, then I have Tumblr. My Tumblr is very explicit. So if you don't want to follow me, that's okay. I will link it down below. Um, but it is N00, um, N00200. So, yeah, there's just, like, a lot of different stuff. And, yeah. I have Vine. Uh, I watch Vine videos because, like, I when I get super incredibly bored, I go on Vine. So my Vine is Chloe. I'm gonna try to link it down below this time because I know it's like impossible to find just Chloe because like a lot of people have the name Chloe. Like I typed it in one time and it was like 
a thousand Chloe's. So yeah, I'm going to try to link it down below if I can find it. Then I have Text Me and I have Kick. Kick I use it to talk to people and then Group Me is another kind of like school app that I use to talk to like people in my AP class and my math class. Um, then I have Fahoto. I really don't know how to say this. But I post every once in a while on here. And then I have Pinterest because like I use Pinterest religiously. I love um, just like my like feed or whatever. Like I love having everything in folders and just being able to look at it. Um, but I have all these different photos. Um, my favorite one's the food one because everybody loves food. And this one literally makes me drool. Um, I love my summer adventures one as well. Then I have Daily Horoscope in my Lifestyles app or folder. Um, basically, you can like read your horoscope. They have all the different signs and whatnot and some other stuff. And you can like look at your horoscope like from today and yesterday and like day before. It's really kind of cool. And then I have uh, Depop because it's like Vinted, but it's a little bit more my style because it has like all these kind of like cool different things um, that people sell. So like say if I wanted this, you can just like press buy and there's my address, you know what, we're going to cut that out. Basically what you can do is like if you want to buy something, you can press buy and it just is so easy. It's just like Vinted. You can just like create your own like feed or whatever by following certain people. So um, some of the features that I'm going to show you that this phone kind of has is again, it has like that cool like whole touch screen thing where you can like hold it like if you want to talk to someone or text someone you can do that so you can like do this and hold it and like see the message before you're there you can also like uh let's see do this and hold a picture and like look at it from there and like you can copy say it's like really really cool would like to update it's really cool and it's kind of worth it if you really want to but you know if you don't want to i wouldn't but basically, that is everything on my iPhone 6S Plus. I love it with all of my heart. I also got it in 64 gigs, so that means I never run out of storage, which is amazing, because that was the worst thing ever, getting a 16 gig phone. On my iPhone... That is everything on my iPhone 6S Plus, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Bye, guys!